So I'm happy to guide you through some new tools and services, uh, empowering planners and integrators for a broad range of installations. Being committed to most relevant open standards, BNB, amongst some other key players in the market, defined a specification for the best interoperation within a media network with every product when implementing Milan. And DNB just launched the first certified Milan product, which is called the DS20 Audio Network Bridge. And for a simplified operation in an installation of a probably quite complex DNB audio system, we now can offer the perfect tool, which is called R19 Touchscreen Remote Control. The power for simplicity. So when it comes to quite complex tasks in an early stage, we now support our clients and integrators and planners with Revit software files. And they are working on building information modeling, or in other words, BIM. So last year, DNB launched the DNB Soundscape here in Amsterdam, and this year's presentation is about what has happened the last year, what were the experiences uh, with DNB Soundscape um, all around in the field. So we got a lot of comments uh, from users and artists and sound designers who used really DNB Soundscape in the last year. We got uh, Chris Ekers and Max Richter using a Soundscape system in OA. We uh, got a comment from Sebastian Frost, who is the sound designer of uh, Sting's last ship musical. So uh, all those comments we uh, were putting together and creating a nice show by also explaining what is DNB Soundscape and how does it work in principles, what are the two software modules and scene and, and space doing. Mm -hmm.